Hello, best friend, and a welcome, welcome back to my channel. Best friend, new blind item alert about Selena Gomez. Any day now, they're going to allegedly announce their engagement, best friend. Right now, if you guys uh, notice, I am getting ready because I am going to a party. Uh, it's my friend's party. So we are going to catch... Uh, a really nice restaurant here in Los Angeles. So um, I'm going to get ready while I spill the tea, best friend. Because, girl, I multitask when I spill tea, okay? Listen, first of all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I'm like your messy best friend who always FaceTimes you. You know what I mean? Like, you know you always have that one friend who is always bothering you and giving you, like, all this, like, tea about the entertainment world or whatever? That's me. And if you don't have one, you have one now. So make sure to hit that subscribe button, best friend. Okay, so here is the blind item. Best friend, what in the dun dun dun, dun is going on here? Oh, Lord Jesus. Listen, I have a face mask on right now, best friend, because I'm about to go to a party. My social anxiety is at 100. But here we go, best friend. My friends at Selenators here on TikTok sent me this shout out that my other friends at Fabulous Dumois posted this blind item saying I can confirm that the currently rumors about the A-list singer and actress being engaged with this very talented producer is true. He proposed her at her birthday party, and I know that they want to stay a bit discreet about that, but they will soon share the news with us. Oh, my Lord. Girl, book Celine Dion, bitch. I need her to sing my heart will go on and on in the damn wedding, bitch. I cannot begin to tell you. Listen, I know it's just a blind item, but I am so freaking excited, best friend. Oh, girl, my, my, um... My social anxiety came down a little bit. You see, look at God. Selena Gomez, girl, even talking about her Cosby down, bitch. Listen, do you guys believe these blind items? Girl, all I know is that I am ready. I am ready to go to this wedding and be the flower girl. And I'm going to slay, bitch. I am going to slay in this damn wedding. Selena, Selena. Ooh, best friend, jump scare. Um, Girl, oh, no. My damn eyebrow thing went all over, bitch. Oh, God. You see, this is why this is why I don't go out, bitch. Listen, what do we think? Do we think that she's getting engaged? Do we think she is engaged? Do you think they're getting married? Do oh, best friend. So, I'm going to just be very, very honest with you guys. Like, blind items, sometimes I'm like, mm, you know what I mean? Like, sometimes I don't know if I believe them or not. But I, I, I actually trust Dumois and... I obviously know that they post what they get sent. So it's not like Dumois announcing this. It's a blind item that they receive. But I just feel like if they choose it, it's for a reason. You know what I mean? I feel like Dumois knows everything. So I don't know, best friend. I really do feel like it could definitely be a possibility. And furthermore, I think that, you know, I I just feel like why 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 waste time you know like why waste time on i'm gonna put this on my face right now this is gonna give me like a little bit of tan because i need it um why waste time when you know you know he's the one you know what i mean so i know it looks super dark but don't worry best friend you just gotta and i do it with my i, I do it with my my hand to be honest i don't know where anything is i'm rushing right now so you know this just kind of gives you a glow doesn't even make you tan or just glows anyways best friend sorry um i just feel like why there's no more there shouldn't be any more time to waste you know what i mean like if you know you know if you know that somebody's the one for you like why waste time just just do it you know and and you know all all you can do is hope and pray that you know they are the one for you and that's it. Like, there's nothing else you can do about it. And and honestly, best friend, there's nothing wrong with giving love a chance. You know what I mean? Okay, so you see, just kind of gives you like a glow. Now, I'm going to do one more little just around here. Because I'm going to put some contour on now. Anyways, so, oh, and of course, <laughs> I have to put some on my neck. Because I'm not going to show my neck. But, you know, you just want to like kind of color correct a little bit. Anyways, um, so I just feel like, oh shit, I did it wrong. So I just feel like, look, if you know, you know, 
give give love a chance, you know? And I'm also going to have my Rare Beauty in a second, but I'm going to put some contour on. This is the very quick and messy way of doing things. So, you know, I'm definitely not a makeup artist, but um, I just kind of, you know, just kind of go with the flow. I really don't really uh, do too much. Anyways, um, I... I actually really do believe this blind item and I believe it because Selena Gomez and Benny Blanco to me they seem like that couple that they just kind of they don't want to waste any more time being separated now there is the talk of religion um I this is definitely something I'm gonna leave it up to you guys but I've been getting a lot of comments that say um actually i do have a blender i've been getting a lot of comments saying that selena gomez is um will have to convert uh because he's jewish i don't know how that works best friend so that is something that you'll have to you'll have to tell me in the comments how that works um because i that's something i really cannot comment on but um but yeah i mean i don't know i just I just feel like they're gonna announce it in the most cutest way possible, like in a in a very like kind of just cute video, you know what I mean? And I'm just so excited because I really do feel like they they deserve it. And you know what? I feel like after everything she's been through, the most important thing that you can do after you've survived so much trauma is happiness is just to be happy to you know to to enjoy life because for so long you know you and by you I mean Selena was you know trapped in this sadness in this you know in this moment of you know mental health and physical health and the breakup and you know, all of these things that she had to go through. Now she's finally in a place where she's where she's happy. And I just feel like she deserves this and she deserves the world. Um, I will tell you this, though. Part of me is a little nervous for her to tell people. And I'll tell you why. Because I just feel like some people are just so nasty to her. Um, I'm just going to put a little dab of this like here. And just like a little here. I don't know if I'm doing that right, but maybe one day Selena can teach me. Um, oh, fuck. Okay, whatever. Uh, you know, I'm a little scared for her to tell people just because people love to be mean to her and they love to, like, you know, kind of try and, you know, break her spirit and try and, you know just just be plain nasty you know what i mean okay so this light you probably can't see much but i'm going to show you guys with this light how it looks hang on so this is how the face looks i like it um anyways i do think that they're all oh hi guys i do think that they're always trying to kind of break her spirit and that is why personally I wish that she didn't make an announcement. Yep, you heard it here first. I wish that she... Girl, what happened to my tripod? Did it break? Fuck. I wish that she wouldn't say anything because, quite frankly, I don't think anybody deserves to know. That's just my honest opinion. I feel like she's given the world so much that why tell... Why? You know what? Why? Why have to tell people that are just going to be mean to you. You know what I mean? So in my in my opinion, I feel like she should just even get married and not tell anybody. But that's on me, girl. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to get dressed and show you the final outfit. And so you guys can see what I'm wearing. Okay. All right. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. This video was super, super quick and messy. But I am... Uh, I'm not running late, but she asked me to be there a little bit early to like get a drink together and like, I don't know, help her out if she needs help. So I'm going to go rush and do that. I love you all so much. Um, this is the cologne I will be wearing today. Um, this was sent to me in my Christmas list. So in my um, Amazon wish list. So thank you so much. I actually love to mix perfumes. I love to mix like, um, 
like I love to mix these two when I go out. And then during the day, I love this Britney one. I love this Paris one. I love like light fragrance fra fragrances during the day. And something I do when I go to bed, best one, is I always put perfume on. And my perfume of choice when I go to bed is Gardein. So um, I don't know. I always saw my grandma do that. And I just do that all the time. I go to bed and wear a perfume. But anyways, let me get dressed and I'll show you guys my outfit. All right, best friends. So this is the outfit that I'm going to wear. I'm going to wear this open. So it's like, oh, peekaboo, oh, peekaboo, oh, peekaboo. But yeah, this is the outfit. I've worn this before, but never with them. So it's kind of like I never worn it. Um, but yeah, I decided to go a little glittery, a little summery. And these are the shoes. So that is the outfit. I hope you guys, hope you guys like it. I feel, I feel good because, you know, it kind of, kind of, you know, I just feel like, just like, you know what I mean? Just kind of like, you know, you know what I mean? Anyways, girl, I gotta go. Thank you guys so much. I love you so much and I'll see you guys in my next videos. Mwah.